Today we will be working our legs and booty in this 17 minute Power Pilates legs workout. This is a quick and easy to follow video which will really target those leg muscles. You're going to feel the burn and feel so much stronger after. We will be using just our body weight to do squats, leg lifts, donkey kicks with plenty of pulses and so much more. Feel stronger and look leaner. You will need a wall or a chair for the first part of the workout, so make sure you've got that nearby. Let's get started. Start by walking on the spot a few times. Then go to the wall if you need to, and we'll do some heel raises. This is really good for your calves. Inhale, lift your heels, exhale, lower. Do this 10 times. That's lovely, do three more. Once you've done that, make sure your feet are hip distance apart and parallel and do 10 squats. Inhale, squat down, push your hips out, exhale, stand. Four more. Do your last one, inhale, exhale. Lovely, okay, from here lift your heels and try to do 10 squats on tiptoes. This is going to be a lot more challenging for your balance. Take your time, really push those hips back and just see how low you can go. Please make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel, it really does help me out so much more and I can continue to make really good workouts for you. That's lovely, three more. On your last one, stay in your squat if you can. And then you're just gonna hold that squat for about 10 seconds. Keep your heels lifted if you can. Well done, do 10 pulses. Do four, three, two, one. Slowly come up to standing. Try to keep your heels lifted. Just walk through your feet a little bit if you can. And then we're gonna go again. Squat down, try to hold that squat for 10 seconds. And pulse 10 times. For three, two, one. Stay as you are, start marching your arms 10 times. Pull your tummy in, try not to arch your lower back and stay as low as you can. Well done, this is tough. Now raise both arms to the ceiling and hold for 10 seconds. Do little pulses, keeping your arms raised. Do four, three, two, one. Well done, come up to stand and bring your arms by your sides, lower your heels. Okay, give your legs a little shake. That really challenged your balance, but you were working your legs and you were working your core as well. Now go to the wall or your chair if you need to, lift your heels, then bend your legs and straighten. Think of this more as a plie. You don't want to lean forwards and squat. You're just bending your legs while sliding down an imaginary wall. Let's do about 10 of these. Do three more. Last one, stay there and try to hold for about 10 seconds. Keep your heels lifted if you can. For three, 
two, one, pulse 10 times. For four, three, two, and one. Then from here, hinge at the hips. You're gonna walk your left leg out and then walk it back in. Do this 10 times. Make sure your toes are touching the mat and then walk your leg back in. Keep your other heel lifted off your other leg. Do four more. Two. On your last one, keep your leg extended. Then you're gonna lift and lower. Do this 10 times. Make sure you're leaning forwards but not rounding your back. Keep that neutral spine. Do three more. Two. Last one, keep your leg lifted and hold for about 10 seconds. And pulse 10 times. For four, three, two, one. Well done, lower your leg, walk it in, unhinge at the hips, come up to standing and then lower your heels. Really good work. Let's shake those legs out before we do the other side. Sadly, we've got two legs, so we have to do both. Lift your heels, bend your legs, hinge at the hips and do the same with your right leg. Walk your leg out and then walk it back in. Try to keep that front leg as bent as you can and keep your heel lifted. Do four more. Two. On your last one, keep that leg extended, then lift and lower 10 times. Well done, three more. Remember, keep your heel lifted off your other leg. Then last one, hold for a few seconds. And pulse 10 times. For four, three, two, and one. Well done, lower that leg down, walk it in, unhinge at the hips, come up to standing and lower your heels. That was such good work. Your front leg was really, really working hard as well. Shake those legs out, then in your own time, come down to four point kneeling on your hands and knees, but come down onto your elbows because we'll be here for a while. From here, we're going to do some donkey kicks. Start with your left leg. You inhale, lift and bend that leg. Exhale, lower. We're doing 20 in total. Make sure you're keeping your upper body still. So engage those stomach muscles and really squeeze your glute as you lift your leg. You've got 10 more. This is honestly such a good workout for your booty. Five more. On your last one, keep your leg lifted and do 20 pulses. Ten more. Five, four, three, two, one. Keep your leg lifted, straighten your leg and then bend. Do this 20 times. Try to keep your thigh nice and still. You're just bending from your knee and then folding back in. Well done. You're halfway there, do 10 more. This is hard, but keep that leg as lifted as you can. Five more. On your last one, keep your leg lifted and straight and hold for about 10 seconds. Well done, three, 
two and one. Okay, from here you're going to create an arc with your legs, drawing a circle in the air and tapping your toes. Really semi-circle the leg as much as you can without moving your torso. Really keep your neutral spine. We'll do about 20 of these. It's really going to target those glutes. you're doing so well do 10 more you've got about five more Well done, once you finish your last one, bring your leg to the middle, lower your leg down and come into a well-deserved rest position. Stretch your arms out and then slowly restack your spine. Okay, let's do the same with our right leg. Come down onto your elbows and when you're ready, you're going to inhale, lift your leg up into that donkey kick, exhale lower. Remember to really squeeze your glute as you lift your leg up. That's so good, we're going to do about 20 in total. You've got 10 more. Five more. Two. On your last one, keep your leg lifted and pulse 20 times. Ten more pulses. Five, four, three, two, one. Then straighten and bend your leg 20 times. Remember not to move your thigh in the upper part of your leg. Do 10 more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Keep that leg straight, then lower and lift. Tap your toes onto the floor and then lift. Do this 20 times. Well done, 10 more. Remember the more you lift your leg back up, the more you're working those glute muscles, but keep your torso as still as possible. Nearly there, five more. And one. Well done, we're going back to creating that arc with those legs. Remember you're drawing that circle in the air, tapping your toes and really semi-circling that leg so that you can really feel this in your legs. Try not to move your torso at all. You're nearly there, you've got about 10 more. You're working your legs so much, you're gonna feel really good after this, not long to go, five more. Two. 
and one well done once you've finished lower that leg slide it in and then come into that well deserved rest position rest your forehead on your mat stretch your arms out have your knees wide for a nice inner thigh stretch take a big inhale and as you exhale restack your spine okay let's have a well deserved stretch turn around straighten your legs from here you're going to cross your right leg over your left then look over your right shoulder for a lovely booty stretch do this for a bit longer if you need to so feel free to pause the video we're going to switch legs cross your left leg over your right this time and then look over your left shoulder Lovely, come to the middle, straighten those legs and reach over, grab your toes if you can and get a really nice hamstring stretch. That's lovely, take a big inhale, exhale, restack your spine. Give those legs a little shake, then come onto all fours, tuck your toes under, downward dog, and then from here, slowly walk your feet towards your hands. Again, try to grab your toes if you can, rock forwards and backwards. Again, we're getting that nice stretch in your hamstrings and the back of your legs. Then from here, inhale, exhale, slowly restack your spine. From here, we're gonna do a nice quad stretch. Bend your leg, bring your heel to bottom, keep your knees together. Lovely, then switch legs. Knees together, heel to bottom, push your hips in. This is gonna feel lovely for your front of thigh. And then shake your legs out. Walk through your feet to finish off. You are finished, that was really good. That was so tough, but you did it. Thanks for watching. Please make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel for more Pilates workouts of all lengths and levels, including lots with equipment. For trackers and planners, check out my Etsy store. This will really set you up for your fitness goals. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.